this is Stampy and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. I'm here playing another round of Hunger Games on a map called The Neighbourhood or Neighbourhood, something along those lines. There's actually uh, not a sign here saying the actual official name of the map, but I believe uh, it's something along those lines. Uh, pretty standard rules. Uh, it was built by someone called Human Slenderman and uh, there'll be a link in the description to his channel uh, if you want to go and check out him and some of his other maps and videos. Um, yeah, so as I said, standard rules, basically last one alive wins, I'm doing an all v all, and uh, I'm, actually I'm going to do a quick shout out here to um, uh, some of the other builders, people that helped with the walls and the chests and stuff, so yeah, there'll be a link to uh, all of the people with channels in the description as well. Uh, there'll also be a link to uh, some of the channels uh, of the people that I'm playing with, uh, I'm being joined by MC Climax, who's the person uh, who downloaded the map and is going to be hosting, uh, I'm also playing with Snazzy Shiz, uh, me, I got Ballistic Squid as pretty much always, uh, Tank Map, uh, Amy Lee and Laney Galaxy and Buildaholic. Uh, so everyone with YouTube channels that's recording, uh, there'll be a link uh, to their channel down in the description and I guess all we've got to do now is wait for Squid. He's always last. Actually to be honest, it's normally me and Squid last, especially when we're together. We're always uh, spending ages chatting and jumping around while uh, everyone else is waiting very patiently in their pods. But um, yeah, I guess this time I'm okay getting in but Squid isn't. I'm actually a little bit worried that I've lagged out just because uh, everyone seems to have slightly frozen. Are we okay? <laughs> I think everyone just might have just stopped moving for a bit. Uh, I think there might be uh, quite a lot of lag in this game. The world does seem to be uh, loading in pretty slowly. And here we go. Uh, we all got permissions. Uh, I believe there's a 30-minute grace period. But I'm not sure how many people read that. I don't think many people bothered to read the sign. So uh, for the beginning, at first at least, I'm going to uh, just try and avoid as many people as I can. And that was a pretty good first chest. I can hear someone, but is someone set on fire already? Is someone like completely burning? <laughs> I can just hear like someone constantly burning. Are you okay? Who was standing in the fire while looking at the chest? <laughs> right, because I don't know if people know about the grace period, I'm going to immediately leg it. And oh, this is nice. Oh, look at all these very well-kept lawns. <laughs> this is quite a nice place. And I'll Gamer tags on actually. Uh, I think gamer tags have been left on, so uh, I suppose that will mean the uh, the game will be a little bit faster paced than uh, otherwise would have been. I don't mind gamer tags on. A lot of people don't like it, but I don't actually mind it too much because it allows you to be sneaky. Because people um, expect to see you with gamer tags. Like when you crouch, it sort of I don't know catches people off a little bit uh, off guard when like it otherwise might not have. And as I said, I don't know. Uh, anything about this map apart from the fact it's called the neighborhood and out my way pig <laughs> so yeah I, i've not explored it i've not seen screenshots i've not seen videos uh, i'm going in completely new and that's always the way i like it and i love this style already i love the like the really well kept lawns and the googlies in my face that no joke really made me job right i'm gonna avoid the googlies for now leave me alone creeper please get out my face <laughs> i just want to have a look around for a little it's always my first goal is just to to survive for long enough to i don't know like explore the map for a little bit and I do uh, only have a wooden sword, so it's probably uh, not a good idea to get into uh, too much hefty combat straight away. Uh, there does seem to be a lot of lag right now, though. The world does seem to be uh, loading in very slowly, which is kind of restricting me. And hello again, Mr. Zombie Friend. Yeah, I've already faced you before. Uh, I've got to have a look inside this house here then, I guess. I'm a little bit scared spending uh, so much time so close to the spawn because I can see uh, a few gamer tags around the area and I don't want to get killed too early. And I just got shot by an arrow. And I'm not sure if that was by a... Um, uh, a person or a googly so I'm gonna assume the worst and guess it was a person is there someone right there as well oh no there's someone oh gamer tags have been switched off now gamer tags are switched off I think there's someone there that doesn't know that I'm here I might actually be able to go and surprise them and get them while they're off guard I think they, oh, they're, they're, they're here looking in a chest. Right, I can take them out. I can take them out where they're here looking in a chest. They have no idea that I'm here. Right, I got them. Oh, that was Lainey. Oh, I feel bad for killing her so early on, but uh, it is part of the game. Right, I got some good stuff here, though. I got some some more armor, a potion of poison, which isn't a um, splash potion, so uh, that's not going to be particularly useful. Um, but yeah, I got some cobwebs as well. Uh, they might come in handy, and some wheat as well. Uh, I guess I could maybe uh, use that if I find some crafting table to, to make some bread or something. Well, there we go. One kill on the board so uh, if nothing else at least I managed to do that at least uh, this game won't be a complete fail and here we go I got some sticks and um, a bit more food there I got a few apples and uh, I might actually go get my hunger up quite now because uh, I don't actually have full health right now so if I get my uh, my hunger fully up and then it will start going back up again and Laney was killed again <laughs> other people like fighting up in the spawn or something I didn't actually see uh, anyone else die I kind of thought that Laney was the first to go down but I don't know maybe there are some some more people down when oh, I got a pumpkin and 
and a diamond home. They've got some, some weird choices for stuff they're putting in the chest in this map. I'm not entirely sure why you'd ever need, like, any of those two items. And there's a big slime there, and I don't really want to bother facing him. If I can try and uh, maybe jump over the fence, and then that way I might be able to avoid him somehow. Oh, I can't, because there's all half slabs all over the place. Um... Okay, looks like I'm going to have to try and uh, leg it past the slime. Should I try and make the slime go in the swimming pool? Come on, slime, come join me in the swimming pool. Uh, imagine that. Like, everyone would go in the pool and it would be like really horrible and slippy underneath it. Right, there we go. While he's having a nice little paddle in there, I'm going to leave him to it. And I'm going to go and uh, head off and try and find someone else. Now, I really want a better sword. That's going to be uh, the first thing that uh, I want to try and get hold of. Because uh, right now I've only got my wooden sword and I've only got uh, a few arrows. Although I did just manage to find some more then. Uh, it looks like there's going to be uh, some sort of a little parkour puzzle here in order to get to that chest up there. So if I sort of jump up here, and then can I get the chest maybe? Oh, there we go. Oh, loads of ender pearls and uh, some more apples. Okay, food uh, shouldn't be an issue anymore. So uh, eight apples will make like will last for ages. Uh, so I don't have to worry about gathering too much food. And yeah, ender pearls are good for escaping. If I get in trouble, I can just chuck one and get miles away. Now look, there's someone over there. There's someone just wandering around. They have no idea I'm here again. That's not Laney again, is it? Is that Laney? gone back inside the map? Or is that someone else? It's a very, like, similar skin. Here it is, it's Lainey. What's she doing? Why is she cheating and come back into the map like that? Maybe that's why she keeps getting killed. Like, every time I look on the kill, kill feed, she's getting killed. Like, she's supposed to uh, stay up on the top of the map. I always prefer it when uh, people die, they leave the game, just, way, uh, just so that way you, you sort of, like, know who's left. Uh, but I did manage to get a, um, uh, a stone sword there, and that should uh, that should help me out big time, actually. So, uh, if I fight someone close range, then um, I'm going to have a decent chance chance now, although uh, it would be uh, better to try and hit them with a few arrows so they can't get uh, close enough to attack me. Alright, I, I guess I just want to go find some people. I might actually go uh, in another direction, like, uh, since I came out of the spawn, I've only sort of explored this street, uh, so I'm, ma I'm maybe going to go uh, in another direction and sort of uh, see where else there is. I kind of don't want to go uh, into any places that haven't loaded in very well, though. That's, that's my only problem. And oh, is there someone over there? I think there's someone just standing. Oh no, that was just this. It kind of looked like someone's game attack when I kind of saw that half cut off. You see what I mean? Like that. If I do that, that kind of looks a bit like someone's game attack. Uh, but I guess game attacks are turned off though, so uh, I wouldn't be able to see that anyway. Right, my guess is that all of the chests around here uh, are going to be already looted from people that ran off in this direction. But I'm going to have a quick loot, uh, look around just to see if I can get anything better. I do have a few sticks, uh, which suggest to me that uh, there might be like diamond or iron like ingots around the place. And so maybe like you can build your own sword, which uh, would be my next big advantage. You know, getting uh, a higher tier of weapon above the other uh, stone sword would uh, really help me out big time. And I guess this place has been explored. Like all of like the doors seem to be open and all the chests seem to be looted. So uh, I guess there's nothing in here. I kind of wish I was playing this map in the day. I can imagine this uh, looking really funky, like you know, like in a really bright sunny day. It has got uh, quite a unique style, you know. And oh, look, there's, there's two people over there. I think they're teamed up together. They're just standing right next to each other. Right, let's go and try and take them out. Oh no, they're going to be chasing me now. Are they chasing me down? Yep, I'm getting chased down. Right, I'm going to end a pole away. I guess those people are teamed up and I don't want to be dealing with that right now. All right, I got away. I've landed up here inside a tree. Right, let's have myself a golden apple and uh, try and survive. Oh no, people have teamed up. Oh, that's not good. Well, not good for me anyway. Oh look, you see them there looking for me. You can see them there down there on the street trying to go after me. Right, let's hide up here on the roof for a bit. I need to get them when they're separated. If they're both together like that, I'm going to have no chance. Uh, do I have anything else to help me out? Not really. I could put a pumpkin on my head, but that's not really going to help me out much at all. <laughs> this is quite a good vantage point hanging out up here. And oh look, there's someone over there as well. Is that person by themselves, maybe? Let, let's go after them. I, I know Tank Matt went over in that direction. I believe uh, that was the person that was chasing me down then. And uh, I got my health fully back up now. So uh, if I do get in trouble, I can uh, try and end a pearl away again. Oh, look, there's someone right there. I know there's a zombie ground here as well. I'm so scared that Tank Matt's going to come up behind me or something. Oh, or a spider will come up behind me. Get out of my face. I don't want to deal with you. I've got enough problem with the players in the map. I don't want to deal with Googlies as well. And that looks like a scene out of like a horror film with him there like on top of a car with like a zombie around the outside. That's kind of quite a famous sight from horror films. Right, I need to try and uh, sneak up on him somehow, I guess. Right, he's trying to shoot arrows at the uh, at the googly. I'm still very scared uh, that someone's going to sneak up behind me. Right, I might just go in for the kill. Oh, the zombie's going after him. I think he just got hurt by the zombie. They just had to face that. Oh, he's running. He's scared. He's got to be weak. Right, I just need to be quick than him. I just need to try and catch up with him, I guess. He's got a stone sword as well, though. I don't know why, I don't know why he's running. Surely he could just attack me, you know, like 
we're we're kind of even the way we are. Oh, where, where's he going? Is he going to try and ambush me inside the house, do you reckon? Oh, he, he shut the door on me. He's there on the other side there. Right, if I stand here and try and get one shot in with the arrow and then charge in with the sword. Right, here we go, there we go. He's got to be weak. He's got to be weak. Go, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. There we go. I managed to take him out. That was, that was MC Climax. He was the host as well. That's the, that's the host down. And he had a whole bunch of loot as well. Right, let's go and try and hide for a bit uh, so I can go and see uh, what it is that I gathered from him. Anything useful? Anything better than what I've got already? Not really. He didn't have much better than me, to be honest. I think that uh, that's not going to help me up too much. But I'm doing well. I've taken out two people so far. This is quite rare for me. And oh, look, there's um, there's a uh, a chainmail um chest plate down here as well. Let's go and put that on, shall we? Let's have a an upgrade from my from my lever. I believe it's better, isn't it? I always lose track about uh, which arm is better than what. I always get confused with gold. I always think gold's better than it is, and you always tell me off for wearing gold rather than other things. It does look fancy, though. Uh, nothing in here. <laughs> the sign wasn't lying, was it? Unless that was looted already. Right, I have no idea who's left then. Um, I'm, I'm kind of scared to, to look, just because um, I'm not sure. Oh, look, someone's taken out. Snazzy Shiz was out. So what's that? We got Climax is out. Snazzy Shiz is out. Uh, and so I think it's me, Squid, and Tank Matt left in. So no matter what, I'm in the top three. I'm, I'm like, at the least, I'm going to get the bronze medal. So that's okay. And oh, look, I can see someone over there. I think that might be Tank Matt again. Should I see if I can go and surprise him? I got loads of arrows, actually. I got 40 arrows. It would be good to maybe get on top of one of the roofs again and uh, try and take people out from arrows. And I realize I am just running straight down the middle of the road here. It's probably uh, not a smart idea. And I totally didn't notice that before. I totally didn't, like, notice that massive model. And uh, I think that guy might... Might be dead. I think that guy might be here just watching. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave him there. He doesn't seem to be too bothered with me. <laughs> I always hate it when people come back down into the map to try and watch because even if they don't hurt you, it's like really distracting and uh, can still sometimes muck people up. But yeah, he doesn't seem to to be following me at all. So I guess it's okay. Right, I believe I saw uh, Tank Matt. Well, I think it was Tank Matt uh, heading in this direction somewhere. So I want to be very careful that I don't get snuck up on. Like, it might have been Squid. I don't think I've actually seen Squid at all this game. Uh, so I'm going to keep a uh, keep a firm eye uh, on him. Like, I've not seen him in the kill feed at all. He seems to be uh, having a little bit of a quiet round so far. And uh, I found a few trees that I can climb up here. Uh, this might help me out. People might not be able to spot me up here. And uh, I can use all of my arrows. I think that might be my big advantage. You know, 40 arrows is a lot. So that should uh, be able to help me out quite a lot. I have no idea where he's gone though. I'm kind of a little bit scared the fact that I saw him running this way. Now like I just totally can't see him at all. He might have gone back around that way maybe I guess then. It'd be good if like after a certain amount of time they switch game attacks back on. And here we go. Oh there's someone there. Someone, there's someone in the distance. Right I, I need to go and try and use uh, my arrows if I can. Try and try and use my range advantage. And the only bad thing is I'm really bad with arrows. I got quite good cover here though. And he's running in with his sword. He's running in with the sword. Right I gotta get him. Oh no he's got an iron sword. He's got an iron sword. Right I'm gonna have to end a pearl away. I'm gonna have to try and escape. I need to fight him at range. There's no point trying to take him out close range if he's got an iron sword. He is gonna win that every single time. Right I'm trying to make my escape try to run away just keep running keep running i need to just break the line of sight then i need to hide for a bit and uh, i want to get my hunger back up just so uh, my health will go up a little bit quicker and i'm still scared of squid what would be oh there's squid up there on top of that on top of that tree up there oh i might be able to surprise and take him out and hopefully he's got a better sword and so i can use his sword to uh, take out tank map right i believe squid is like directly above me he seems just to be standing on the top of the tree no wonder he's not seen any action all game he's here just playing monkey and climbing up on all of the trees rather than joining in with the fray. Wait, where is he? I think he's like up here somewhere. I'm so scared he's going to come and like surprise me and ambush me. He is a bit of a slippery squid, you know that guy. And I probably shouldn't break the leaf blocks. So you can probably hear that. Oh, where did he go? Where's he disappeared to? Um, I saw him. He was standing right on the top of the tree up here. He's just disappeared. Squid? Squid! Squid, I'm not going to hurt you. Come on, we're friends. You know, we're buddies. Magic Animal Club to the end. Where is he? <laughs> Do you, do you think he's just run off? Do you reckon he saw me? Or that you heard me break the leaf blocks? I'm scared he's going to be rounded trying to ambush me. And uh, I, I can't forget about Tank Matt either. He could uh, be somewhere round here as well. Has he just disappeared? Oh no, he's, he's, just, he's gone off again. Okay, so what I, what I think my best chance is, is to go after Squid first and try and steal his loot. Oh no, he was taken down. 
Uh, okay, that guy's not in. Oh, there, there's Tank Matt right down there. I can maybe shoot him with arrows from up top of here. And then when he's weak, I can dive down. I think he's there trying to pick up all of Squid's stuff. Right, I can catch him off guard here. I think he's there trying to sort out all of his infantry. And oh, my aim is so bad. I don't think he has any idea where I am. He looks so confused. I think he thinks the slime's hurting him. He went after the poor innocent slime. Right, he's got to be weak. I can go and charge him. He's, he's probably trying to, like, make me chase him. I need to make sure I don't get too close. I'm not letting him uh, get into sword range because uh, then he's just going to take me out instantly. And it's so distracting just having uh, someone else running around in the map as well. But oh well. Right, so um, yeah, I just, I just need to keep the range. And then I just need to, I don't know, just try and take him out. I'm scared he's going to try and like end a pearl right to me though. I'm in a bit of a rubbish position here. I don't really have much cover. If I sort of... Uh, try and stay behind this tree. Oh, he's charging in. He's charging in with the iron sword again. Right, I need to run. I need to run. I need to run. I need to run. Is he still going to chase? He's just going to chase to the end, isn't he? We're the only two left. Oh, no. I'm going to have to end a pearl away again. I'm going to have to end a pearl away. I know I'm being an absolute pansy by continually doing that, but I don't, I don't want to lose. If I go and fight him now, I just know I'm going to lose. I need to, to fight him long range somehow. And uh, is he chasing behind me? Okay, I don't think he, he knows where I end a pearl to. And there's a random chest here just like already open, just left there open. That's a, a little bit odd. Uh, there's not many other weapons, is there, really? Like, I really want, I don't know, like, some some like splash potions of poison or something. You know, I just need anything just to, to tip the battle in my advantage, because if I do fight in close range now, no matter how well I swing my sword, I'm gonna get taken out, and oh, he's right down there again. Right, here we go. I can fight him at range. I'm really weak, though. I, I need to get to, to some sort of cover so I can get my, uh, my health back up again. Uh, this is how I need to fight him, though. I need to fight him at range like this. This is when uh, I've got my, my big advantage. I'm just scared he's gonna sneak up on me though. Oh no, he's right here. He's right here, right? Come on. Come on, Stampy of the jungle. Jump along the trees. I need to get away. I need to get away. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, I knew it. It was inevitable that he was eventually gonna track me down. Where did he get that iron sword from? I had no chance against him. That was a really fun round though. Like, I managed to get a few nice kills in there and uh, I had to settle with second place, but uh, I think Tank Matt uh, was the better man and I did spend almost the entire map just running away. Right, so I'm gonna give you a quick glimpse here uh, of the entire map. Quite a nice little map. Nothing too fancy, but uh, very well contained and seems to be uh, pretty well balanced as well. So I had good fun uh, playing on it. Uh, so yeah, thank you uh, to MC Climax for inviting me into this game. Uh, thank you Human Slender Man for building the map uh, that gave us all of the fun today. And uh, thank you to all of my other competitors uh, for being competitors and joining in with the fun. And uh, most importantly, thank you uh, for watching the video. Uh, hopefully you're joining me next week uh, while we play playing Hunger Games on a different map. But that's the end of this video. Thank you once again very much for watching and I will see you later. Bye!